the fuck going on with y'all man welcome back to another episode of boruto now before i get into it make sure you guys look at the links down below you can find a link to become a member of the channel click that join button with that you will have early access to my youtube videos where i'm currently five episodes ahead on all the shows that i'm watching and if you want to watch the full reactions instead you can head over to my patreon where i'm also five episodes ahead and last but not least you can find a link to my discord server down there as well click it join it and have fun with our community all right so last episode of boruto pretty much uh we had a few fights right uh we found out that this kokuto guy with the fucking weapons i i, I like his fighting style i think he's pretty damn cool um he's pretty he, he's strong he was able to take on pretty much everyone inushika cho serata boruto and he didn't take much damage or, or any at all to be honest right so he's dead he's pretty damn strong uh, the other guy, the Daydara power guy, um, we had Garaga's help for a little bit, so we were able to take him down, uh, you know, a notch. Um, so that's good. Also, we found out that these guys are not human and they were created. And I think the only person in the world that can create these kind of people so far that we know is Orochimaru. So Orochimaru is in fact behind this and we, 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 we almost confirmed that when... You know they had that little meeting that lord orochimaru blah 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 blah, right um but i was still skeptical but orochimaru definitely is behind this right uh why i don't know but he is uh if anything it's probably for mitsuki's sake because you know um and this is strange to say but maybe orochimaru is actually taking up that parental you know role as best as he can and the only way he knows how and Orochimaru only knows how to do some shady ass shit, but in a good way, in a weird good way. He's always been the gray area, moral, morally gray character, right? Um, so he's raising Mitsuki the way he knows how, and that's through some fucked up ass missions, <laughs> through some fake betrayal, through some double agent shit. It is what it is. Through lying to him, whatever. Orochimaru is Orochimaru. He will always be the weirdo. We get it, right? So the way he raises his kid is probably also going to be weird, and I think that's just that. I'm gonna go ahead and guess that's what's going on right now. Just like we saw, uh, you know, when we saw, when we first saw Mitsuki's stage mode, when Mitsuki met his older his older self, that was Orochimaru, you know, raising him, trying to be, make him become better than he is. Because I mean, the the point of you having kids is your kids are supposed to be the better version of yourself, and it's supposed to keep going and, and upgrading, right? And that's and that, and that, that's Orochimaru's theory. Um, so I think he's helping Mitsuki out right now. Um, but then again, we we don't know we don't know anything really. Uh, we just know that Mitsuki is searching for this, this is his will and he I think he's searching for something so we're, we are pure, pure speculation right now nothing is confirmed um, but in any case Mitsuki did hit Borto with that with the snake lightning which kind of hurt me just for a little bit but we know it's it's for the long term because Mitsuki just needs to keep rolling with these guys until he finds an answer to something right and um, yeah so that is where we are so without further ado, let's jump into this bitch. This is Boruto episode 80. Like and subscribe. あ、手動する形でも。うん。おいでよ。僕たちを作った人に合わせてあげる。その人に会えば本当にわかるのかな。僕の知りたい答えが。やっぱり興味あるんだ。意思の秘密ってやつに。Hmm. <笑><笑> Interesting. So yeah, I mean I mean, I, that was a weird conversation because they said they're going to meet their creator, right? Mitsuki knows who's, who his creator is. Do they not know who their creator is? So maybe what's going on here is Mitsuki is not the lost one here. It's the rest of them? Because the rest of them are trying to find Orochimaru, maybe. Like, these, these could maybe be Orochimaru's failed experiments teaming up to go find him. And then Mitsuki's the one that has to be the double agent. That's what that conversation means to me. <laughs> so most of the time you guys have probably already noticed that I, I skipped the intros because most mostly the intros are just a recap of what happened, but that was actually a flashback into what actually happened. Uh, an important conversation between Mitsuki and his new group of friends. So yeah, that was that was interesting. Like and I already already said my thoughts on that little conversation, so so clearly we knew this, but now that's confirmed that Mitsuki is I mean 
he's either joining them to figure out what the fuck they're up to, right? Or he is truly trying to find out his purpose in life. Or both. Fuck, to be honest. Shit. <laughs> Yeah, he's being deconstructed. Huh. I think I'm... Yeah, so one of my theories was these guys are the ones that are lost and they're trying to look for Orochimaru to fix them because maybe they're now breaking apart because they're experiments. So obviously they, they don't sustain off normal food. They sustain off like experimental stuff. Stuff only Rochimaru has, so they're trying to look for his ass to restore their bodies. I don't know. That's what it looks like. He's clearly deteriorating. Damn. No, it's happening. And it was foreshadowed when we had the Onoki episode. It's bound to happen. This could be the first, like, you know, um, Paramount character death. The most impactful one. That's going to happen in Boruto, right? There were a few of those in Naruto, Shippuden. And now it's going to happen again. So, she's the Sushikage. She better not lose to some fucking randoms. She better not. Did she just lose? Hell no. I swear, they are making the, the, the Kages look weak as fuck in Boruto. I'm sorry. They instantly got taken out against Momoshiki. <laughs> I haven't forgotten that. Why are they making them look so weak? それ何花だよ。人間は病気の人の見舞いに花をあげるんだ。これを見て元気を出してって。シェット。Well, that's actually kind of fucking adorable. And pretty wholesome. That may be Mitsuki's most wholesome moment in the show so far. It makes it even more wholesome that he's completely oblivious and that I you know, on how actual humans act. <laughs> the Sekie guy just said, Lord Ku made him. That's what he meant by that, right? So they're, they're, hey, they could possibly be another person that could create beings like this. Oh! Shit. You let your guard down, Mitsuki. Fuck. This guy's smart. Damn, I thought we were having a tender moment. That's true. Orochimaru could have forced the opinion on Boruto on Mitsuki as well. I didn't even think of that, bro. That would be actually tragic if that's the case. Forced to like someone? Ooh, that sounds awful. Sekie! <laughs> Man, why did that dark character gotta, gotta die first? Fuck, man. 
I mentioned time and time again how much I actually fuck with Daydara and his power. And then they're taking him out first? That means I don't, I don't get to see it anymore. Oh, he's still alive. Oh, shit. Good stuff. Nice. Good save, random girl. Good save. Ooh, we found out her power. She can read emotions. She's the the truth serum. That's dope. I'm gonna go ahead and call her an empath. That's what they call them, right? People that can read feelings, empaths. I think she, that's what she. I think that's exactly what she is. I don't think we've actually seen that power in Naruto yet. おお、<笑> Also, I don't recognize his face. Are we supposed to know where his face comes from? I don't recognize it. Also, I have another theory on Ku that I would like to share as soon as the episode is over. Okay, good. Um, <clears throat> so, my theory on Ku is he was the one that said the Lodorochimaru thing, right? It was him or the scientist. So that means I think Ku is actually um, an experiment of Orochimaru. And Ku maybe was supposed to be the Mitsuki before Mitsuki? Like Orochimaru, like Ku was the experiment that, Oro that, that Orochimaru was supposed to deem his greatest experiment ever, his greatest invention, right? But something went wrong. Okay, and that led to Ku running away or to Ku being dropped off somewhere in the dumpster. I don't know. But now Ku is taking what Orochimaru taught him and making his own things because they are calling him Lord Ku as if they as if Ku created them. Right. And he's clearly making these like, aqua to things. So if this Ku guy knows how to make things, that means and he mentioned Orochimaru, then maybe he, he used to be Orochimaru's apprentice or maybe he was Orochimaru's first experiment, like first real experiment. Something like that. Something along the lines of that. The pieces are slowly coming together, slowly but surely. I'm trying to I'm trying to make theories, I'm trying to put them together. And I wanna do it before they actually reveal it because it's that's just fun. It's just fun to do, right? Again, if I'm wrong, I don't fucking give a fuck. Okay? I don't care if I'm wrong. Right? If you guys are getting triggered by how wrong I am, don't. I'm just guessing, man. I'm just, it's just guess. I'm just speculating, right? This is just fun for me. You know what I'm saying? Don't get triggered if I'm wrong. Just don't. It's just, it's not worth it. <laughs> There's so many more things to be, to be triggered about in the, in the fucking, in your life. Um, anyway. So that's what I think was going on. Um, shout out to fucking Sekie. I kind of want him to join the squad now. He actually looked out for Mitsuki and saved his life there because they all would have gained up on him. That girl's power, I just noticed she always has her eyes closed, but when she opens them, Instead of Cyclops fucking shooting out a red beam, she can see within your soul. <laughs> I think she is an empath. An empath is someone that can read into your feelings and then use that to understand, like, you know, what kind of person you are, what your intents are. She's like, she's like a truth serum, basically. Um, but I'm sure she has more than that, too. Maybe she's, maybe she's like a telekinesis, too. Who knows? But that, that is, she's definitely an empath because she, I mean, she told how, what Mitsuki was feeling, right? So there's that. Um, but yeah. How is that? Okay, this Lord Ku get, uh, also, I mean, it would make sense for Lord Ku to be associated with, with Orochimaru even more because, dude, he was able to take out the Chuchikage. Now, I know these, uh, besides Naruto, these, uh, these fucking, these new levels of Kage are kind of, uh, you know, 
well, ex I want to say except for Naruto and Gara, but I feel like the Tuchikage, the Raikage, and the Mizukage. Uh, I don't mean to sound like a hater because I'm not. I just call it like I see it, and what I see is the Tuchikage, the Mizukage, and the Raikage are all severely weaker than their predecessors. No, they seem so much weaker. Onoki would not. Onoki would have bodied that guy even now in his old age. I feel like one fucking particle style jutsu. He's dead. How does she not know particle? We haven't seen her do particle particle style, have we? Well, maybe we have. I'm just hating. But still, they the dude. They look. They feel so much weaker than fucking uh, a or Tunade. Or sorry. Or a uh, freaking uh, May the 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 lava style Mizukage and freaking. Um, Onoki, they just seem so much weaker than them, you know? Like, God, it's kind of annoying. <laughs> they, they're Kages, man. They should be strong. It shouldn't just be Naruto and Sasuke. I mean, I guess it should be because they're Naruto and Sasuke, but they, they, they get, they're not even close. Naruto and Sasuke will 2v4 them, maybe even faster than Momoshiki did. You know what I'm saying? So, they're just so weak. <laughs> Fuck off. They need to, they, they need to be stronger. Um, hopefully then the, the next ones coming up will be stronger because I don't know how, how much they're going to evolve during the show, but what I'm seeing right now is not too goddamn impressive, man. Like, we're definitely going to deal with some fucking Kaguya level disasters again, right? They can't be getting bopped immediately. They can't be. And this is something I should have mentioned in that Momoshiki fight when they, when they did get bopped immediately. It's embarrassing, dude. God. <laughs> That's, I don't know, it's, 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 it, it, it's annoying, but it's also kind of hilarious if you think about it. So... Anyway, um, hopefully B uh, Boruto is okay. He took a hit. He did take a hit. And uh, I definitely need to see more of the Mitsuki's, Mitsuki story. We need to see more of the Mitsuki arc. Again, I'm making a lot of guesses. I'm making a lot of theories, a lot of speculations. But we, d I don't know. I don't know what's actually going on. And I'm very excited to actually, to actually see because I'm getting more curious per episode. Like the level of mystery is increasing. Um, and it's starting to make sense. You know, uh, so the, the slowness of this arc is starting to get to the point where I'm like really invested now to where I just like I'm really intent on listening and figuring out the story. So I think that's pretty cool. So anyway, that's going to be it for this reaction, guys. Uh, but before I end, make sure I look at the links down below. You can find a link to become a member of this channel. Click that join button. You know, what I'm saying with that, you will have early access to my YouTube videos where I'm currently five episodes ahead on all the shows that I'm watching. And if you want to watch the full reactions instead, you can head over to my Patreon where I'm also five episodes ahead. And last but not least, you can find a link to my Discord server down there as well. Click it, join it, have fun with the community. Other than that, I'm out of here. You guys have a good one, and I'll see y'all for the next episode of Borto. Night. Peace.